Hi everybody, how's it going? This is Dells. Um, sorry for the scratchy throat. It's really, really smoky out here in the Northwest right now. Lots of wildfires happening. <laughs> but I kind of just wanted to check in a little bit and kind of talk about comics again. <laughs> um, yeah, so I've been kind of trying to do this thing where I work on my comics 15 minutes a day if I can. Um, and it's been going pretty well. I haven't really missed a lot of days. I started at the beginning of August and I've only missed like maybe five days. So it's going pretty well so far and I really enjoy getting to sit down and just trying to discipline myself. Like I recently got a timer, just like a little kitchen timer that I like to use for timing it. And it's pretty pretty good because it just it's something that's like oh okay it's only 15 minutes I just need to sit down and finish 15 minutes but by the time the timer starts beeping I'm ready to just keep going and going <laughs> it's been going really well I think it's been keeping me on track for updates I'm really excited I'm really thinking that this is gonna work and this is gonna keep me on a weekly update schedule for my comic Wing Chun Chips, and I'm super excited and happy about that. And I, I'm trying to alternate the days between Wing Chun Chips and Guardian Academia. It is a Rise of the Guardians fan comic that I and some friends started, I don't know, maybe like four or five years ago. Um, but yeah, it's that comic is planned start to finish, and I want to complete that comic. And I've been using these 15 minute spurts, sprints to kind of work on it and just chisel it away. <laughs> it's, it's going pretty good. I'm almost done with this really tedious chapter. Oh my gosh, it, I wanted to do an action sequence because we do need some action in the story but action is not what I'm the best at so it's been very challenging very frustrating so I'm gonna be I'm gonna be happy to get it over with and get back into the dialogue and the comedy of the story um, but yeah you know it's, it's been going really well my one issue with it though is that my days don't finish until, I don't know, about 9 or 9.30. I work 9 to 5. I have Kung Fu like 6.30 to 8.30, three times a week. And, and I get home at like 9 and I have to sit myself down and do comics, which is a good mindset to have. But when I get in that, when I get in the zone and I don't want to stop, before I know it, it's 11 o'clock at night and I need my sleep. <laughs> it's, it's very tricky. I don't, I don't know what it is. It's a little, it's kind of annoying, I guess, because I do need my sleep. I'm, I'm, I'm one of those people who like, my circadian rhythm tells me to go to bed at 1030 and if I don't, I regret it so bad the next day. All the double shot coffee in the world is not going to help me. So I am going to start trying to do these little things in the morning. Before I even get out of my pajamas, I'm going to try to do 15 minutes of comic work. And I'm kind of foreseeing this being only for like scripting or drafting, probably not things like line work because that's going to require me to actually be awake and have good coordination and be warmed up and everything. So I'm going to start that tomorrow morning and I kind of want to do these like a little vloggy style videos and just kind of chat with you guys and talk about what, what's going on in my brain. I think talking about it, interacting with people, having that energy just swirling around, it, it helps me feel really creative and 
I don't know, it's just a good feeling being surrounded by creative people, people who are excited to do comics or art. It's it's infectious, you know? So I was I was gonna start doing this next week because I'm going on vacation for a couple days, but I'm, I guess I'm just too excited to start it, and Thursdays are the worst days to try and come home and do comics, so I better start in the morning, and we'll see how it goes. So wish me luck, you guys. I'll talk to you in the next video. Bye-bye.